Hello, I'm back again with Word of the Day, so let's find out what word it is. It starts with I and ends with R. It is commonly used in mathematics. It is a whole number. It represents or represented by Z or Z. I'm sure you're going to guess it now. So easy. Great, and the word is integer. And it's a noun. Let's look at the definitions. It belongs to mathematics, which means a whole number, such as 3 or 4, but not 3.5. An integer. From the Latin integer meaning whole is colloquially defined as a number that can be written without a fractional component. Alright, so let's look at the example sentences. 6 is an integer, but 6.4 is not. Integer arithmetic should be used. To avoid the problems of approximate answers, is it asking you to use these type of values? Complete number, the whole number, and not this one, to get the approximate answers. Great! You are right! Okay, here are some synonyms to integers, numerals. Ciphers, symbols, totals, numbers, digits, figures, signs, notations, holds. Do you have any antonyms in mind? Great! And here are some. Part, zero, zilch, zip, none, letter, commoner, one, four, Entirety. Let's look at the pronunciation. Remember, it's very important to learn spelling and practice pronunciation of the word. Here we have a couple of pronunciations. The very first one is the British English pronunciation. The other one is Native American English pronunciation. The only difference is, here in British English, the R is silent when it is the last alphabet of the word. And in Native American English, it is pronounced. Okay, now listen and repeat. Integer. Integer. Once again. Integer. One last time. Integer. Now Native American English. Now listen and repeat. Integer. Integer. Once again. Integer. One last time. Integer. Fantastic! You have learned a new word. See you again.